Hi guys, uh, Marvin and Kidder coming to you again. How's everybody doing out there? Um, just wanted to give my thoughts on this. Um, found out uh, not too long ago um, that um, we, something new is coming from Marvel. And you know, I'm, I'm very proud of them for doing this because there's not a lot of characters of this religion in that universe and is depicted as heroes. So it's really good for me. Um, now that Carol Danvers, guys, is still going to be Captain Marvel, fine, you know, but some people probably would say, okay, so what, what would happen to her previous persona, Ms. Marvel? Well, it looks like Marvel is going to answer that question, guys, sometime in the future, uh, with a new Ms. Marvel, um, and once again, I'll leave the link in the description where you can read it and everything like that. But, um, it's a part of the whole new promotion, the all new Marvel now, you know, the whole second wave. And, um, this character will debut in February of next year. And, uh, this will be a new Ms. Marvel. Her name will be, uh, Kalma Khan. Uh, I hope I'm saying it right. And, uh, she will be of Muslim descent. She'll be a shapeshifter. And uh, what I've it'll be written by G. Uh, Willow Wilson, and uh, the artwork will be done by And Andre Andre uh, Al Al Alfano. I uh, hope I'm saying his name right as well. Uh, he's done recent work for the Runaways, or you know, done recent work for the Runaways, and currently is doing work for Uncanny X Force. Uh, Basically, from what I've read, um, she will be a huge, huge fan of Carol Danvers, uh, and she will be in Jersey City, uh, and she'll be from uh, a family from Pakistan, uh, and so she she'll grow up pretty much to really she really will be a big fan. So that's that's cool for me to hear that. She just doesn't take the persona. She has followed Carol Danvers for years before she became Captain Marvel. And she feels, okay, let me be the new Ms. Marvel. I'm just wondering, okay, more about her shape-shifting abilities. Where does this come from? But they have said that she will be depicted as a very strong, prideful young woman. She, I think she'll be 16 years old. And that's great. You know, I, I find that very cool that, you know, Marvel is doing this. I mean, with DC bringing Simon Boz, you know, now Marvel's doing it. And I don't mind that the companies are kind of copying if, if that's what you want to go with. But it's good to see that more minority characters, heroines, heroes, whatever, are being brought into the fold. And especially of Muslim descent and, you know, Arabic descent and Middle Eastern descent looking more, depicted more as heroes and not just the villains and things like that. So I'm, I'm very happy about this and I, I will probably, I will check this out. I'm, this will be a read for me. I will check this out and see how Ms. Khan comes out as the new Ms. Marvel. So I want to hear from you guys. How do you feel about this? How do you feel about the new Ms. Marvel coming? How do you feel that she's going to be a teenager, 16? She's going to be in her sweet 16s. And uh, give me the whole nine yard, guys. Just give me all your knowledge. Give me all your input. I want to hear from you guys. How do you feel about this? You know. And uh, other than that, guys, this is Mom Vernon Kid saying peace, one love. Stay tuned. Keep real, guys, as always. Uh, I'll catch you guys on the flip-flop. You guys take care.